Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Tonbu means dragonfly in Japanese as well as in Tamil which has thousands of lenses in their eyes. Tonbu Imaging is Bengaluru based tech company which is a spin out of Sarnoff Corporation and Stanford Research International. The team has rich experience on a range of battlefield modernization technologies, immersive surveillance and strategic electronics for military applications. It's truly a world-class company whose night vision optics are even used by US and Israel's special forces. But today we are not going to discuss about their optics but anti-tank guided missiles which is being developed by Bharat Dynamics Limited in collaboration with Tonbo Imaging. The missile is called Amogha 3. The most critical part of any missile is its seeker which guides the missile to home into target. The seeker which is going to be used in Amog 3 will be EOIR Electro Optical Infrared Seeker System. Tonbo Imaging is going to use an ultra light uncooled cooling system in the EOIR seeker. This seeker will not require a cryogenic compressor to cool the image sensor which is going to reduce its cost by almost one third. This is a superior technology not available in most of third generation ATGM. If you talk about NAC anti-tank guided missile, it uses a cooled seeker which is heavier and costly as well. Further, NAG and many other international ATGMs does not have artificial intelligence capability, whereas Amog 3 will have the artificial intelligence to further improve its accuracy. It will have inbuilt libraries of infrared images of military targets. These targets are used for training the algorithm to correctly categorize, classify and identify various military targets. The missile also has capability to identify target and identify its weak spot. For example, we all know that modern day battle tanks are weak from top. The missile has ability to change its course and reorient itself to the weak spot of the target automatically. Tonbo Imaging will also be providing the Commander Launcher Unit or CLU for the anti-tank guided missile. CLU controls and launches a missile and engages with target before launch. The target is initially acquired by the CLU. The target picture is then fed into the missile seeker, which also has AI capabilities to identify the target. CLU can send target information such as its pictures and coordinates to the seeker to engage before launch. Once the missile is launched, the EOIR seeker by Tonmo Imaging guides the missile to homes onto target with precision in centimeters. Once the missile has been fired, the gunner has no control over it and missile using its seeker and artificial intelligence algorithm identifies and destroys the target which makes it truly fire and forget missile. This allows even manual and wireless interaction and control between CLU and seeker. The EOIR sensor video processor Artificial intelligence ensures that missile never misses lock on its target even if target is mobile. This missile will have range of 2.5 kilometers. As per the CEO of Tonbo Imaging, the procurement plan is for 2,300 pieces initially. Once the company has demonstrated its capability, then the total requirement is a few thousands every year because India is lagging behind in this capability. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We'll be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.